All right, guys, we got another victim for the Magoo. There's the Magoo, and here's the Bayang Toys X15. This is the brushed version of the X16. So we'll see if it can <clears throat> handle any of this Magoo stuff any better than the um, the Promark Shadow Drone. That thing did not perform. Uh, the weight uh, of the Magoo killed that thing. Well, let's see what this does. Well, it seems to be performing a little bit better, no doubt. I got it in, it, this uh, quad only has uh, two rates, high and low, so. Oh, this thing is performing way better. Than the Promark did. And basically it's the same quadcopter, you know. Seems to be rocking around a little bit here. Got a little bit of wind kicking up, but it's nothing, uh, nothing that severe. You try to get the, you're not going to trim out the wind like I told you, but you can do a little bit. Yeah, this thing is performing way better than the uh, Promark did. And they're both SEMA X8 style quads, so I don't know what the story is with that. But this thing seems to have way more power than the Promark did. We'll try a little punch out on it. It is wandering around quite a bit. There's a quite a strong pitch in that higher rate. There's some wind gusts coming in. It's bopping it around a lot, so.
All right, guys, I just wanted you to see that the X15 here is a uh, much better option for except for my great landing skills this X15 is a way better option for your Magoo than the um, than the Promark this is you saw that thing flying it was way uh, this thing has way more power than the Promark way more I would say double double the amount of power all right guys thanks for watching